Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I'm doing a spirit message for sign of Taurus. And keep in mind, this will not resonate for all of you. Okay? If you'd like a personal reading, I'll leave that description down below. Another thing you do is we have memberships on the channel, so you go ahead and join. Become a member. You can access to all those perks. Taurus. On the bottom of the deck, for the overall energy, for your current situation here, we have the High Priestess. And that is Pisces energy, but with the high priestess being here, it tells me that you're in a very intuitive state. You listen to your intuition. Like, I feel like a lot of you, your intuition is very, you're connected with it. It's high. You know. So you know what, what you're supposed to do here. You have the Six of Wands. Two of Pentacles. Knight of Swords reverse, Eight of Wands reverse, Judgment reverse. We have the Emperor, Aries energy, and the World reverse. So, Taurus, something in your life is incomplete. It is not over yet. The World reverse. Uh, another thing, Taurus, I see you being successful. The Emperor, Six of Wands. Those are both very good success cards. Entrepreneur energy, it's like overall, it's good, right? However, with these, this other stuff here. Something in your life is incomplete, and I see you kind of questioning whether or not to... Like, do that again to give it a second chance, but I see a lot of you kind of leaving it alone. Judgment reverse, Eight of Wands reverse, could be someone that you're not speaking to. So it could be a person. Either way, I see a lot of you kind of leaving it alone. On the bottom of the deck, what's coming towards you, we have the Three of Wands. Taurus, I see you doing well in life, but three of wands, when you look at this one, it's different. This deck is different from most tarot decks, so its interpretations are different. Okay? I see a lot of people, like, trying to get in the way of your success, trying to, like, throw obstacles in your way, throw wrenches, you know, just trying to, like, mess up your, your little, well, not little, but life. Right? Like a jealous sort of energy. We have the King of Wands, Fire energy, Page of Pentacles, Three of Pentacles, Ten of Pentacles, and then we have the Five of Swords. So Taurus, I see big money coming your way, stability, Ten of Pentacles, Three of Pentacles, something you've been working towards, possibly working with someone towards this. I see you. Taurus, whatever whatever goals you have in mind, I honestly see you being the one to be able to achieve that. So whatever you put that you want, I see you achieving that. Whether that be money, success, stability, you going somewhere, you're doing something. I also feel like spirits by, by your side, so that's another thing that's helping you. But I see you ending like a lot of things that are getting in your way while you're doing this. So let's see messages for you, Taurus. We have number 12 with Sage of Higher Knowledge. So this goes back to this High Priestess over here. So you, you know, you kind of know things before you you do things, right? With intuition. But, Taurus, kind of get the full story or the full facts before you just jump into something. Or before you just, like, listen to someone. Right? Kind of research first. We have number 12 with the Temple Path. see a lot of you going towards this more spiritual side. Or opening more to your spirituality. We have number 21. The Enchanter. Dream. I wish upon a star and my dreams come true. So yeah, Taurus, whatever you want, whatever dreams you have, you have that ability to manifest it in your life. Closure. I also see you getting closure from something, Taurus. Number six with beauty. So Taurus, this is like seeing yourself as beautiful and the world around you as beautiful, like in a positive way. Okay. Last card for you, we have number 34, the Emerald's Loot. So let's have a look at that card. Taurus, where's the book? 
I can never find it. You have won a victory, beloved. A victory over the past. I don't know what's wrong with my voice. And the emerald loot is sounding through every cell of your being, heralding your rising vibration as you leave fear behind you once again. In fact, the loot says you are growing fast and spiritually. You are outgrowing your old life even more so. When your vibration changes, so too does your life, beloved. This is natural. It is safe and loving for you to release that which no longer feels right for you. No matter how much it was important in your old life, it may not have the same place in your new life. It's Taurus, this is like letting go. This is evolving. You know, letting go of things that are holding you back. Some of you already have done that. It's, you know, you're just progressing more in life. So Taurus, that is all I have for you. Let me know if that resonates. Thank you for watching. If you want to see more content, don't forget to like, subscribe. Bye guys.